Yeah. Uh, it was a good experience. Um, learned a lot of new things. Uh, learned what I should do outdoors and get ready for outdoors. I mean, work hard in the weight room, work hard on the track, and um, as a team, come together more and try to build chemistry better on out for outdoors. Um, I run the 60 meter dash and I run the 200 meter dash. And the 60, um, I think I did pretty good in my prelims the first day and the semifinals on the first day. Um, but I didn't think that I execute the way I should in the finals because I had a groin injury. I really think that I could have done a lot better. But I also PR in the 60 meters and in the 200 meter I did good in the prelims but the finals I did not execute the way I should but I also got a lot of PR in the 200 as well. I'll say I'm happy but I'm not actually satisfied because I know I could have done a lot better. Okay. So that gives you some motivation maybe for outdoor season? Yes sir, that gave me a lot of motivation to go in the right direction now and know what I have to do to get those girls because I really think I could have been up there with them. Thank you. Thank you. I'm uh, Chris Hart. I'm a redshirt sophomore at 141 pounds. I just took seventh place at our national tournament. I dropped my first round match 9-5, I believe, and then I had to win my next three on Friday night to advance to the to advance to Saturday, which is the All-American rounds. On on Friday, my three wins, all of them went to overtime, and uh, well, two of them went to overtime. One was a one-point win. And then Saturday morning, I dropped my first match uh, in double overtime, 7-6, to six, which dropped me down to the 7th and 8th place match where I wrestled uh, Brad Steele from Dickinson State, who's the kid who beat me in the first round, and I came back to beat him 4-3 to three for 7th place. So overall, it was a good tournament. Our whole team wrestled well. We tied for 16th place, which uh, qualifies us for the national dual tournament next January. So I'm at, we're, and we return everybody on our in our team this year, including uh, Jose, who took second the national tournament, 174 pounds. So next year we're expecting big things. Uh, we're expecting at least me, me and Chino are expecting to win it next year. I'll be 141 pounds again. He'll be at 174. We're expecting to take home gold next year and hopefully bring home uh, at least a top 10 team finish at the national tournament and hoping to do big things next year for Wayland. My name is Jose Alvarez. Uh, my nickname is uh, Chinos. A lot of people must go know me as that. Um, I just got done wrestling the NAIA 2013 tournament for the year. Uh, it went well for me. I was I made it to the finals. Um, I won all my matches up until the finals. I had the returning national champ in the finals. He ended up winning a close decision, and. Um, that's about it. I ended up second at the tournament for 2013. Tell me a little bit about that last match, kind of how that, how that worked for you. Well, I mean, it, I kind of had a little bit of stage fright. The mats were elevated. It was it was on a big stage, cameras all around. A little bit, it, I was a little bit stage frightened by the by it, but nothing that really messed up my performance very much. Um, the match, well, I was the the other, my opponent, he got a, right off the bat, he got a five-point lead. He threw me in the front headlock and scored five points off of it. And uh, I was just faced with uh, having to come back on the, having to come back for the rest of the match, and I wasn't able to, so it, it ended up five to three. It was a devastating loss. It hurts a lot losing in the finals. And so all I can do now is just get ready for next year and make sure that don't happen again. You have high hopes already. Looking forward to next year. Uh, yeah, just working harder. I know I, you know, I just painted a big old bullseye on my back, and I know other wrestlers are gonna be training hard. They're gonna be coming after me. So I just need to work even harder to make sure nobody can beat me 
or and I can put myself back in the finals and fix all my mistakes that I did this year.